I'm Jonathan Andrade, and uh, the show I'm presenting here at the power plant brings three projects. The first one is O Peixe. It's a film done in 2016, shot in 16 millimeter film. And it tells a story of a group of fishermen who embraces the fish at the moment of this, their death. It was somehow a, a poetic vision I had, imagining it, it could speak about the limitations on how humanity naturalized the idea of dominating nature. And this image, to me, it uh, brings back the position of, uh, of man in the position of species. The fish also, for me, it speaks about the limits of how humanity deals with nature, using the nature resources as if they didn't have an end or if there weren't consequences. The second project is it's called uh, the Posters for the Museu do Homem do Nordeste. It's the Museum of the Northeastern Man. It's a project that started in 2012 and 13. It has 77 posters that uh, the audience can move around. I invited workers to pose for the poster of the museum through classifieds in the newspaper. And the classifieds would bring uh, very ambiguous texts like uh, I'm looking for a man of good manners and strong hands. And uh, it's important to say that the Museu do Homem do Nordeste is a museum that exists. It's an anthropological museum built in 79 in Recife by the sociologist Gilberto Freire, who was one of the main uh, like historicists that created a theory on how Brazilian miscegenation happened. In doing so, I created a double museum, like, uh, like a second museum. And using the same name and, wor and working only with men, I make this one almost as a gender museum. And I emphasize the sexism of the original title of the museum. The third work is called The Uprising. It tells a story of a, a horse race with carts that, are, that I organized in downtown Recife. Laws were being made to, to, to gentrify, you know, to clean up socially the city. And uh, the carters were, were being forbidden to go around the cities, but they, they are super part of the culture. They are totally part of the, of the local landscape, the cultural landscape of the countryside. I asked for a permit to shoot a film that had a scene of a horse race. And being that fiction, uh, I was authorized to do so. And the other piece shows a documentation of the horse race. The title is What's Left of the First Horse Race of Downtown Recife and we can see contracts, uh, notes, uh, headlines, like newspaper articles that speak about the crisis of the horses in Recife, but also of the Brazilian crisis that is so strong at the moment at, at so many levels. We had like a, a coup that took out the elected president for a non-elected illegitimate president. And we are going through a very harsh times. So these, speaks, uh, these works speak a lot about these political moments. And uh, this is something that makes this show very, very strong to me.